right, Devin, you ready? I'm ready. All right. Three, two, one. What is up guys and welcome back to the vlog. Today I decided to wear the fedora again. Got Devin with us right now. We're actually headed off to Walmart. I need to pick up a couple of things. I need to get a longer ethernet cord. Also need to get some deodorant since I smell like a dumbass and I ran out. And not only that, but I need to get Rachel some allergy medicine or some cold medicine because she's feeling like complete shit. She's still sleeping right now. She had a killer headache again when she woke up this morning. So I need to go grab her some medicine. I threw on a sweatshirt and some pants today because it was one of those days when I woke up and I'm like, it's probably going to be cold outside. I just had a feeling it was going to be cold. Yeah, no, it's like 85 degrees right now. I'm sweating my ass off. So I jumped in my car and I noticed that the time said 2.30 and I'm like, holy fuck, it's already 2.30 in the afternoon. But I forgot last night we set our clocks back. So I actually ended up getting an extra hour of sleep, which was perfect. Now I just need to change my clock back an hour. Also getting some more brushes and some things of painter tape just so I can finish up painting in the garage. I want to work on the garage today for at least a couple hours. I know it's probably gonna take longer because there's like a lot of fine painting that needs to be done But we'll see what we can get done today First wall that I'm deciding to work on today is this wall just because that's where this rack goes up against and I'd rather get this done first that way I can clear up some of this room just by being able to put this stuff over here back That was over here like all my tires and everything Devin's trying to balance on a fucking 4x4 over there Alrighty guys, so we have obviously established that I'm no Tim the Tool Man Taylor, but we got mostly this side of the garage painted. It's looking pretty good. I just have to peel the tape along off the top of the ceiling. And I wanna head to Home Depot really fast right now. One, because I need more paint. And two, because I wanna see if I can get some black styrofoam to cover that copper pipe. Obviously because I painted all over it. And two, I think it's just ugly. So it'd be cool if we could get black styrofoam to go around that piping. Oh, pipe it up. Oh, pipe it up. Oh, pipe it up. Oh, pipe it up. And this wall right here in front of us right now is the biggest bitch to paint. We've gone and done maybe four coats on this wall and there's still fucking spots. We've gotten different textured rollers, etc., and nothing seems to be working. Anyways, like I was saying right now, we're getting ready to head off to Home Depot really fast. I just got done coughing up a lung. <coughs> it is still considered Rachel's birthday weekend. Are and now my okay? voice has changed. Yeah, my voice changed because I fucking sucked the spit down the wrong fucking tube. You look like you're dying. <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to continue this thought in a few minutes after I Catch my breath. Um, fuck. Uh, fuck, it won't go away. Now I sound like an old ass man. Cringe it up. Cringe it up. Cringe it up. Cringe it up. Anyways, like I was saying, <clears throat> I finally got my voice back a little bit. It's still considered Rachel's birthday weekend, so she really wanted to go to Cheesecake last night for dinner. Why well, Cheesecake, I mean Cheesecake Factory. And we had leftovers from when we went out to eat earlier in the day, so we just end up eating those. But tonight, we're gonna go to Cheesecake Factory after we go to Home Depot. And I'm trying to think, I really wanna use the katana and cut through something else, but I'm not too sure what yet. So of course, I forgot to bring the piece of paper or the top of the can to see what kind of paint it was. That's gonna have to wait. We're gonna have to go home later and maybe come back tomorrow to figure out the right paint to get. But we are gonna go try finding that styrofoam plumbing lining or whatever it is. And they just had the perfect size tubing that I needed to go over the copper piping in the garage. So I think that's it for here. Definitely gonna have to figure out the paint that we need though, because we do need more. You guys are gonna get hit by a car. About to get fucked up. Oh. <laughs> I don't wanna dodge that shit. Not from behind. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Even from behind. That was nice, right? I said, whoop! Oh. <laughs> About to catch the fade with the styrofoam, boy. Come on, you got it in my eye. You, you fucking poke me in the nose. Huh? You poke me in the nose. Ooh. Oh, it's done. No, dick's off limits. Dick's off for Harambe. <laughs> I don't care what any of you say. I definitely whooped Rachel's ass with that styrofoam. My nose hurts a little bit though. I got you, good. Looking at the sky, 
This is how you know I'm a fat ass because I look at this guy and I automatically think cotton candy and get hungry as fuck. So here we are at the Cheesecake Factory about to get some good ass food. Honestly, it took us a minute to find a parking spot, so I have a feeling it's gonna be a pretty long wait. If not a long one, a decent one. Decently long dick wait. I really wanna clarify something for you guys. What is wrong with uploading my vlogs is not my cable. And it's not YouTube as a whole, it's my YouTube channel. And I'm working with my YouTube partners to get the issue resolved, but I see you guys saying like, oh, it's your internet, blah, blah, blah. I had the cable guy at my house yesterday, if you guys had paid attention, and you guys would know that he did everything he could and the issue could not be fixed. It's not something with my internet. I've tried uploading my vlogs on different internets, different places, and it still has the same problem. I've tried on different computers, therefore, it is my YouTube channel. I also see some of you guys saying dumb things like, oh, maybe you're editing late or you're too busy to upload the vlog if you guys have paid attention to my Twitter post and my snapchat post you can see that it was taking over 12 hours to upload my vlog so clearly I'm not late on editing when I just proved that it was taking hours to upload my vlog anyway some of you guys like really need to actually watch the vlog before you comment on them and just say dumb things that make absolutely no sense or are even relevant to what is going on but to all my true supporters thank you guys so much for watching even though the vlogs have been going up late. Hopefully we can get this issue resolved as soon as possible. Rachel and Devin are both drinking Shirley Temples. I got myself a cucumber lemonade, which is actually really good, and then obviously just a lemon water. And Rachel got a lemon water, because in Mexico, lemons are limes That's and limes. True. Oh, anyways, she got a lime water. Rachel was craving some cheesecake buffalo wings. One thing that's weird, I mean, maybe it's not so weird, but Rachel does not like blue cheese dressing, but she has to have chicken wings with ranch or else she won't eat them. I got the ribeye steak with mashed potatoes and green beans, I believe. Devin got some chicken enchiladas, and Rachel got the four cheese pasta with chicken, which is what Lance and Lizzie always get every time they go to Cheesecake Factory. <laughs> so we're out to eat, and I came to the conclusion that mine and Rachel's relationship is so different from any other relationship, and here's why. You know, a lot of couples argue about like money and bills and that kind of stuff. Me and Rachel argue about which way I perk my ass cheek when I fart. And like, there's this. He's sitting right next to me while I'm eating. Perking his ass up my way so he can fart on my food. No, she's a liar. We finished up our food and decided to come to Walmart. Rach, what do you need to get here? Since I didn't get a birthday cake on my birthday, I want to get a birthday cake. Oh yeah, we're going to get Rachel an ice cream cake, and then Devin and I are going to get tons of different cans of colored spray paint. And I think we're going to chop through them with the katana. I think this dude over here is sleeping. Got Devin and I some face masks so we're not inhaling all the paint. I think we're going to go with some fluorescent colors like the green, the yellow, the orange, the pink. Squaw! Devin uh, made the call, so I think that means he found the goggles. I'm trying to think of what other color paints we should get. Maybe like one of those light purple ones over there. And then maybe one of these like red ones up here. You gotta, so I got us some goggles, the got these spray paints. Right? Rachel's massaging me and I'm about to fart. To and then I'm also getting this lamp so we can, was it stink? Damn. And I'm getting this light so we can light up the garage. Yeah, I need to clear out of this area right now. It's pretty bad. So we're probably going to do it up against this wall. I got some plastic to cover it so it does not get ruined since we just painted it. But we have to clear this stuff out of the way. Chloe, get over here, Missy. Look at her. She look, she's so funny. Right now we're just kind of preparing this area to do katana versus spray paint cans. And I think this is good. But besides it looking like we're about to shoot a scene of Dexter in here. Got the light set up. We got all the tarps set up, the plastic. Now we have to get the paint cans, the katana, and I gotta get my tripod for my camera and we should be ready to go. Alrighty, so if you guys are ready to see Ninja Sword versus spray paint cans, I need you to smash that thumbs up right now. We got everything set up. I got a bag around my camera so the audio might be a little fucked up. At least you guys can see everything and I really don't want my camera getting ruined, but we're about to get this shit started. So right now we are getting ready to chop through. This right here we have the hot paint. Here we have the katana, aka ninja sword. Pretty fucking sharp. Let's see if we can chop through this can. Almost forgot to put on the mask. That would suck. Probably would have died. Yeah. Alrighty, kids. Do not try this at home. We got proper eyewear and fucking facial wear, or whatever the fuck this is. We're about to chop through this shit. Alright, Devin, you ready? I'm ready. Alright. Three, two, one. Dude! 
<laughs> oh my god! We're gonna have to paint over that. Oh, it's so sticky! Bro, that shit's strong. Next color we're doing is fluorescent green. Here we go again. Three, two, one. Oh my god. Dude, I look like the fucking Incredible Hulk right now. Alright, next color is getting hella sticky. Oh shit. Alrighty, now we're doing yellow. I can't even see how these goggles, but let's do it. <laughs> Alrighty. Three, two, one. is the gold. Flip it on there, Dan. Oh, All righty. Three, two, one. I don't even know what happened on that one. It's fucking gold, though. Oh, shit. It's all over my feet and everything. That was actually really cool looking. All right. Next color. Light blue. If you guys are enjoying this, make sure to smash that like button. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh! No! Oh! That was not supposed to happen. Oh, shit. Yo, that shit went fucking 316 fucking paint everywhere. How many colors you got left? Two more. Two more? Let me adjust this camera a little bit. It definitely got messed up because this fucking uh, thing is sticking. Here we go. Let me do this like this. Alright. Three, two, one. What's the last color, Dad? Fluorescent red. Fluorescent red. Alrighty, here we go. Make sure you can see it on the camera, please. <sighs> yeah. Alrighty, three, two, one. Oh. Dude, this looks so sick. Look at the sword. Holy shit. <laughs> What'd you say? So it probably wasn't a good idea, but fuck it. Look at your fucking head, yeah, bro. Yeah, I can't fucking get the paint off. I need you to go get that rubbing alcohol out of the garage. All right, we got rubbing alcohol for Cody. Now let's go uh, see if he can clean this stuff up. Right now, huh. me and Rachel are trying to figure out some shit to help Cody get the paint off. Because he he's an idiot. He's an idiot. <laughs> Google says we could use oil and shit. Yeah, we're going to use some Pam. Try that out. If that doesn't work, we'll use some Filippo. See how it works, guys. Yeah, because right now he's been in the shower for like 30 minutes trying to get the shit off. So we got most of the mess cleaned up. I think we did pretty well yeah. for the most part. Um, yeah. Avoiding making a mess. Just kidding. We got fucking blue spray paint all over the ground. You guys can see right here where I chopped through it on this side. And I just created so much combustion that it fucking exploded a big fucking hole. Oh, oh, make it more of a fucking mess. That's great. But we did get most of it cleaned up. I think this stuff will just come up with some paint thinner. Uh, a little bit over here. Definitely a lot of paint on the sword, but that'll clean off with paint thinner too. We have a little bit of cleaning up to do, but for the most part, this, this bullshit. Devin got his shoes dirty. This could have been a lot worse though, you know what I mean? Yeah. It like is. it definitely could have been a lot worse. It is a lot worse. No, like my whole garage could be covered in paint, but my shoes are covered in paint. I think we're good. You know, a little spot over there on the corner. A little bit on that wall. Not too bad though. As for myself, I got cleaned up pretty well too. Uh, got most of the paint out of my hair. 
I definitely still have some on my skin. It's probably gonna take a little bit for that to come off. You're an idiot. <laughs> I know. Always doing some crazy shit. But I know the vlogs have been kind of boring lately and they've been kind of short. Thanks for the fucking spotlight, ah! Dad. And I wanted to do something entertaining for you guys and I thought, you know, I found the katana today when we were cleaning up the garage a little bit and I was like, yo, it'd be cool to like cut through something other than pumpkins. What can we cut through? We did the pumpkins and the glow sticks and I was like, how about spray paint? And we did it and I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, once again, please give this video a big thumbs up. You guys know I like my likes. But we definitely ended the night on a good note and it was extremely fun to do that. And I bought these lamps at Walmart for like 30 bucks and it's gonna really come in handy because there's so many other times where I've needed a light and haven't had one and this fucking light is bright bright light Oh, I got paint on my camera lens ruin my shoes a little bit ruin Devin's shoes a little bit Paint all over the face mask here are my goggles right here covered in paint here Let me put it in the fucking this nice bright light for you guys I think it was definitely something cool to do and I hope you guys did enjoy that. Now that is what I call a fat ass glass of fucking water. I made Thank it you. come true. Come, see you, um, thanks babe. <laughs> I'm drinking out of a fat ass glass that says the D and I'm drinking the water through a D. That's fucking funny. Cute. I was like, we should all, all have our own personal It's an cake. ice cream cake so it's kind of frozen. Yeah, and it's about as small as my wiener. Yeah. Hella small. small. It's bigger than my boobs. <laughs> Everything's bigger than your boobs. Alrighty guys, so it is currently the next day. The time change kind of has me messed up because I actually ended up falling asleep pretty early last night and now I feel like I overslept. But it is a good day. It's a nice day in Las Vegas today. I got quite a few things that I need to take care of, but I hope you guys enjoyed the Katana versus spray paint cans. I think that's about my fourth time saying it in this vlog. You know, a lot of these crazy things that I do, there's like a lot of time and effort that go into it. You know, it took us quite a while to clean up the mess last night and it was trash day today. So I'm just hoping that they took all the spray paint cans and all that shit. Shout out of the day is going to be going out to Devin Hanna on Facebook. Thank you so much, Devin, for sharing all of my posts every time my post on Facebook. I really appreciate it. If you guys would like to be shout out of the day, make sure to follow me on all my social media accounts. Links are down below in the description and make sure to give this video a thumbs up and that can help better your chances at being shout out of the day and I will see you guys tomorrow. <laughs>